It's the National Football League on EA Sports. And we've got a showdown in the NFC West. It's the Cardinals and the Niners. And it's coming up next on Madden NFL 23. Gold's got it on the tee. He kicks it off, and here we go from Levi's Stadium. And here comes a return from just beyond the goal line. And in hindsight, probably should have taken a knee as he only gets this out to the 16-yard line. And here comes Kyler Murray in his fourth NFL season leading this Cardinal offense. Already a two-time pro bowler in his time with Arizona. And he slides and covers up at the end as he's going to be able to pick up decent yardage. Now a man in his second season in a Cardinal uniform. Here's James Conner. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. Murray going to try to throw on third down. Open man is Anderson. And he is going to have a Cardinals first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Murray again. This is Connor. And this defense not giving him anything there. Maybe a yard up to the 36. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. Murray going to throw. And that nearly an interception here on this opening drive, but he gets a reprieve. It's third down. Murray now to throw. And that is incomplete. Anytime he reads man coverage, I don't think it's going to be the only time he'll try and hit that route to the outside in this game. He'll test the perimeter, but that time, they were up to the challenge. And it's out of bounds. Now we'll see what the side judge says. He says out at the eight-yard line. Let's go old school there. That's absolutely a great coffin go, corner punt. Someone's put some time in working on that. It seems like every year these guys get better and better. It's amazing how they can command that football through the air. Yeah, they used to actually practice with hula hoops where they place them and try and put them there. Now a lot of guys use barrels on the sidelines to try and put the football in one. And brought down, but not before reaching the 25. They'll get 17 on that one, and the Niners have a first down. They fake the give. Now Garoppolo looks to throw. And he takes this up to the 40-yard line before being corralled. Another first down as they call his number again. He's got 15 yards here. Garoppolo looks to throw. On the move to his left. This will be caught. It's Samuel. And he's finally taken down. And it's a big game there. And it'll turn out to be the final play. No score after one on EA Sports. And yet again, it's Garoppolo. And he will find his man, Samuel. And they're going to be set up down around the 15-yard line. Line of scrimmage, the 15. It's first and 10. Inside the red zone, it's Garoppolo. This one into the hands of Kittle, the tight end. Here we go, here we go. Second and three from the nine. Out of the pistol, McCaffrey. And he's going to take it in. Touchdown, San Francisco. Christian McCaffrey, a nine-yard touchdown run. And the 49ers go nearly the length of the field and finish it off with six points. Gold with the extra point, and that makes the score 7-0. So that drives seven plays in length. And the last play on the drive, the touchdown run from Christian McCaffrey. After the touchdown, it's Robbie Gold now to kick it away. And a touchback as Dorch elects not to return it. So the Cardinals offense back onto the field here for their second drive of the game. They'll be looking to match that touchdown from a moment ago. 7-0 is the score as they begin with a first down. 
And he is going to lose yardage here. The former first-round pick, Eric Armstead, the one who got in there to make that play. Two minutes on the clock, second quarter, 7-0 ball game. At the 23, it's second and 12. Here's Murray. He'll get this complete to Rondale Moore. And they work this well upfield across the 45. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and 10. Murray now. Eluding the pressure right. Murray has it knocked loose. Fumble. And this is going to be 49er football. With no running backs in the backfield to help pass protect, all the receivers in their patterns, it's going to be hot routes if they sense a blitz or pressure on the quarterback. They've got to be prepared to break routes off early and get the football. In this case, uh, never even had a chance. They popped the ball free in the backfield. Over the middle, complete to Samuel. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. Now a first and 10 at the 11. Garoppolo now, rolling to his left. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. It'll be a loss of seven on the sack, and it brings up second. Another try after the first down sack. Garoppolo, and this throw incomplete. Well, the defender all over him that time, and it's going to lead to third down. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And he's got McCaffrey open, complete. And he'll be brought down well short of the first at about the nine-yard line. They do get ten back, but still a ways to go on fourth. The kick by Gold is good, and that will do it for this first half. So, well, time is of the essence. We breeze through halftime, and we are ready for the second half. And we welcome you back now. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, getting set for quarter number three here. It's the 49ers out in front, and they will get the football first as well as we are back and started in the second half. And a decent return out to the 27-yard line. Debo Samuel and the 49ers back in possession here. And I know that they've double teamed him a couple times, but not a ton. Whatever they're doing isn't working. He's up over 100 yards. We'll see how they adjust. And when they do that, they weaken their defense in other places as well. And how many times have we done games where we've seen a guy have a big game like this? But it's usually not by himself, is it? Usually it opens it up for other people that have big games as well. On play action, now Garoppolo. Back to Debo Samuel for consecutive catches. Touchdown, 49ers! Debo Samuel, 53 yards. And the 49ers come right out of the locker room and score here in the opening minute of the third quarter. Gold able to tack on the extra point, and that makes our score 17-0. The long touchdown pass gets him six on a very, very tidy two-play drive that time. And a touchback as Dorch elects not to return it. The Cardinals offense now ready to get their first opportunity here in the second half. And their halftime hole now even deeper. They need a big drive here just to answer the first touchdown of the second half scored against them. They were down at the half. Now, as you mentioned, they're down a little bit bigger, but no time for discouragement. Just got to get back to it, right? Put your shoulder against the boulder and start pushing and try and get back to where you were to start the half. Oh, he's got a little daylight. And yeah, they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. Right back to Connor here on first. No, bottled up, fumble, it's out, it's loose. But I think a Cardinal was able to gain possession, yes, so they will hold on to the ball. So they keep the football, but now face second and long. Murray giving to Connor on the draw. And he'll be brought down just shy of midfield at the 49-yard line. 
This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Here's Murray as he sets to throw it. Trying to fit it into Moore, but it's intercepted. Picked off by Fred Warner. And into the end zone, a pick six for the 49 D as they score the touchdown. Well, I mean, you get it. They're trying to make something happen here in this third quarter, CD, but I don't think a pick six is exactly what they had in mind. No, not at all, because this offense, they've been stuck all game long. Haven't done it the scoreboard yet, and they're kind of forced to take a few chances here, and that one, it backfired in a big way. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six, and now the kick is away. And a touchback as Dorch elects not to return it. The Cardinals offense now works their way back onto the field. I kind of feel like they've reached a do-or-die point in this game, Charles. If they're going to try to pull off an impressive comeback, it has to start right here, right now. Yeah, now they've got a final chance to get out of this situation, but they also understand they've got to move the ball and move it fast. In addition, they need to save as much time so they can get two more possessions. He'll get this to Connor underneath. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. Back now here in Santa Clara. A lot of happy faces in the crowd at this point as their guys have a big lead here to start quarter number four. On first and ten, here's Murray. And he'll be brought down inside the 40-yard line. So from inside Niner territory now, this is first and 10 at the 39-yard line. Here's Murray. Steps away to his, and he can't find anywhere to go with it, and he goes down. And Nick Bosa so quick on the outside, he gets in there to bring him down. Well, partner, you and I will be headed to the airport, but after this game, when it's interview time, someone's going to ask this quarterback what hurt worse, the interceptions or the sacks. This whole day, it's been rough. Barring a miraculous comeback, this offense is going to win this game, but he's probably going to say what hurt most is the loss. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Try to force it to Hopkins, and it's intercepted. And the Niners are going to take possession of the football. How about one last great play defensively, and that should, for all intents and purposes, finish off this shutout. That's as good a defensive performance as we've seen in a long, long time. And I know as a team they will celebrate, but I will guarantee you the defensive guys, they'll get together somewhere and have their own private celebration. A shutout, that's something to be cherished. And they'll be inside the 25 now at the 24. Six yards the pick up, and that's a first down. They stay on the ground. McCaffrey again. And he will lose yardage and be backed up to the 24. They'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. Up the gut, McCaffrey. And they've got it inside the 10 at the 8. That one good for 17 yards. And now they've got it first and goal. They'll run with Mitchell. And he's going to be met at the line of scrimmage and taken down. No gain on the play that time, and it sets up second and goal. And now we're going to get a timeout. Somewhat pointlessly called with three seconds to go in a game that's already been decided. Oh, now look at this. They're lining up to add three more. A little insult to injury here late in the game. From the right hash, and this one just a chippy. And his kick is indeed good. And the lead increases even further. It's 27 to nothing now. So the victory here for San Francisco. And this was truly a total.